This is a tutorial for Brian's Movie by Peach Bet. Uh, it's a nice little song. Um, this is for acoustic guitar. So there's four chords in this song um, that you're going to need. The first one is basically an A. Um, so you bar the bottom four strings on the second fret with your first finger. Um, there's a cap on the fifth fret, by the way, so technically it's the seventh fret of the guitar, but we'll call it the second fret for the convenience. Um, so that's the first chord. Um, another chord you're gonna need is D major. So open fourth, so uh, open D string, second fret G string, third fret B string, second fret high E string. Um, then you're gonna need E minor. So open low E string, second fret, second fret on the next two, then the bottom three are open. Um, and then G major, so third fret, second fret, open, open, third fret, third fret. So that's the chord you can need. The song starts like this, so so it's down, down, then you put your little finger down on the third fret, so you change the D major to, I think it's like a D7, something like that. Um, so it's down, 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 with the, the pinky down, and then take it off and go up. So. Oh. Uh, if you can, after that, just do a quick little stop on the guitar. Um, um, then you go to the, the A, A chord that we said from earlier. Um, Then you do E minor. So down, 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 up, stop. Then do the little same strumming pattern as you just did for this A chord again. So. Um, now, then after that, it does this again. Then it goes straight to the E minor. Oh, hang on. So it's D, do the little little finger thing. Um then E minor, G major, then the little A chord thing. Um, now, that is the intro. After the intro, you go into the first chorus. This song's a bit weird. It starts off with a chorus. Um, and during the first bit of that, you do the progression of D major, E minor, G major, A, two more times. Um, so it's... Uh, So that's the two times through, then you go to just G, uh, hold that for a second, Holy fucking shit. so it's G and then A, um, and then you do a little run, it's like a Mac in my old basement, so you do half bar changes of D major, uh, e minor, G major. It's like I'm back in my old basement. 
and then you hold the G for the next line. Maybe well, a bit of the next line. Um, then you switch to the A again. Let me off explain. Um, and then you do the little run again. Cause he's the last dude in the paper. Then you get to the pre-chorus, which is a bit weird because you do it after the first chorus, but hey ho. Um, then for for that you go way So you for the first sort of half of the line, um, you do the A. Which is E minor, so it's A E minor. Uh, on you come um, to be honest, for a lot of this song, there's not a strict strumming pattern. As much as I hate this phrase, just to sort of feel it out a little bit. Um, uh, so. three times, those little changes, um, and then you, for the last line of the pre-chorus you're just going to hold the A, so Seems it's my side now. Uh, To give you an idea, the strumming pattern I'm doing there is just down, up, down, up, uh, seems, seems it's my side now. So down, so it's basically down, down, then alternating down ups for the rest of it. Um, then once you've done that, um, you basically just stop for a second um, and then go O, oh, and then when it gets to man, you come back in with the E minor. So and you basically once you've done that last line of the pre-chorus, you stop the guitar. With, the, with your hand, with your left hand, with your fretting hand, so you mute it and strum the guitar. Do like a little muted strum. Um, then you wait. Oh! Then you're back into um, E minor, G major, A. Um, then D major, E minor, G, A. And for the for that second chorus is basically it is um, you do all of the same stuff that we've done before for the previous chorus except the start because you're coming in from that pre-chorus um, from here you miss out the D that you would have done at the start of the first chorus but other than that it's the same. Then you move on to another um, pre-chorus, then another chorus, then another pre-chorus, then a little bit at the end that is just oh. So you miss out a lot of the chorus on that last little bit. It's just a small section, um, but other than that, that's the whole song. It's just a. Succession of courses and pre-courses. Um, yeah, that's it.